Okay, I think we got the Jumbotron situated. Sorry, guys. Appreciate everybody's patience. Um, while we get, thank you. We'll get uh, questions for Mike, my girl. Guys, put your questions in for Mike. Uh, first question to Tim Fitzgerald. Hey, Mike. I mean, no, not really. Uh, I'm, it's a it's a blessing to to be able to have this uh, happen. But uh, you know, you wish it was the whole season. But man, this was special, and this was this was this was a great, great, great game. Yeah, beating TCU was great, but uh, did you feel like it all kind of came together tonight with beating a top ten team at home? Um, honestly, we we sort of felt it come together all along. I mean. I'd say it really started with Texas a and them, and then, um, you know, with, just with this schedule we have, it's, it's, you know, we're in the Big 12. We play tough teams, and so we were coming along the whole time, getting better the whole time. Uh, and then last game against TCU, we finally we found it. We found it, and um, now, we, we, now that we found it, we feel like we could keep pushing forward and win some games. So that's what happened tonight. Got how, good, how good was that team defense tonight? Oh, it was great. I mean, huge. Everybody, everybody stepped up on defense. It was great communication. Shout out to Coach Henderson with a great, great scouting report. Um, big time switches. Everybody, everybody played their role tonight. It was, a, it was a team effort, and uh, it was a lot of fun to be a part of. Congratulations, Mike. Thank you. Next question to Kellis Robinette. Hey, Mike, congratulations, first off. Um, tell me about that string of three-pointers, right when it looked like you guys were uh, maybe letting the game slip away, you come up with those. What what was going through your, your mind when those start going in? Uh, I mean, y'all know I like to let it fly. So uh, I was, I was, I was just, I was feeling good. And, um, you know, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of time in the gym, I mean, I trusted trusted myself, trusted the work that I put in with my teammates, my coaches, and um, shots were able to fall. Just believe. Was that the idea coming down when you knew that they'd taken that lead, that you, you had to do something right there? Uh, that's not, I, mean, I was just thinking, do, do what I can to help the team win. And um, tonight, at the, end, at the end, it was make some shots. I mean, some shots, uh, got, I got open. And I, I made one, and I felt, I felt good. So I just felt good. I felt felt good all night, but you know, some don't fall. But uh, at the end, it felt really good. And did did it have any extra meaning? I mean, I I know you still got one more game here this season, maybe more next year. But it did did it have any extra meaning that it was technically on senior night for you? Um, you know, it, it's. Uh, I've past couple of days I've really reflected on my time here and um I've, I'm truly blessed to be in this position that I am in and um it's been a great four years um so tonight uh, I wasn't even focused on me go like killing or whatever I was just I wanted I just wanted to win that's what I told my teammates and um man I got I got the greatest teammates anybody could have and um they were there they, they did their part we all did our part and um, we got the win. So that's that was really special on my senior night. Thanks, Mike. You're at the end. Thank you. Next question to John Kurtz. Yeah, Mike, maybe it's not fair to ask you to reflect on this this quick after the game, but where, where does this rank as far as your career highlights when you think <laughs> uh, as I've had special moments here. I don't, I don't know. I don't know yet. Um, obviously, in, in my head, uh, in my head, I'm really thinking like I wish this could have been the whole season because it really could have been. We, I mean, we we had everything we needed. We were just getting better the whole time, learning, and um, it due to the year, due to a lot of people not being there. I mean, it, we can make we can make all the excuses in the world, but uh, we didn't. We just kept pushing, and um, you know, from the outside looking in, it, it might look rough, but things are great over here, and um. Tonight, tonight was well deserved for my teammates, myself, and my coaches. I appreciate it, Mike. Thanks, man. Thank you. Uh, next question to Ryan Black. 
Hey, Mike, uh, this, how much does this mean to get this win? Because, again, we've kind of repeatedly talked to you after these losses, and you you know, kind of took it on the chin and, and said, you know, we're getting better. I know the results aren't there. But, like, to actually get the result tonight and knock off a top ten team at home. Yeah. And, uh, I mean, uh, you could look at all, all those previous uh, post-game interviews, how you wanted it. But I, I truly meant everything I said in all those times that – we're blessed. We're lucky to be here. Um, we're getting better. Uh, we're listening to the coaches. We got great coaches, and we're just growing. We were growing the whole time, and um, you see, everybody was able to see what we're capable of. And um, I'm grateful for Kansas State uh, fans, the ones that like you know, fans that were patient the whole time. And I, I know it was a rough season, past two seasons, but things things are things are going well over here. And then. Does how, how does this feel you after the 13 game losing the streak? Now you've got back to back Big 12 wins. Uh, it's a blessing. Uh, you know, they've been, the coaches have been preaching to us the, the greatest the greatest uh, thing about a game is the opportunity to play, and um, we just <laughs> we 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 have we I don't know we've missed one game this year maybe I don't know we we've, we've got we've got almost a whole season and I mean there was a lot of injuries, COVID people out but. We've been able to play this whole time, and it was a blessing to play the whole time. And now we're able to get some wins because we we took we took all we took all those losses. We took them like men and um, growing, growing men, and um, that's what we're doing. And now we're able to get a few wins, and hopefully we can keep it going. Thank you, Mike. Thank you. Uh, next question to Michael Billings. Yeah, Mike, you got some uh, offensive contributions from a number of different guys tonight, including Davion and, and Deshaun. Does it show that you guys have uh, have some scoring capabilities that hasn't necessarily stepped to the fore yet this year? Uh, I wouldn't say it like that. We we have plenty of, plenty of talent on this team, and it could come from different people on different nights. And um, we knew tonight that uh, – we had an advantage inside, and um, Davion, Davion's just, he works his tail off every day, every single day. He comes hurt, sore, it doesn't matter. He comes and he works, and he deserved this moment tonight. He was huge in the first half especially. We, I mean, we wouldn't have been in the game in the first half without him, so he was huge. And um, Dejuan, you know, it just, he just, things haven't gone great for him either. He hasn't made shots all year like he'd like to, like he's capable of, but he stayed positive, and I, I don't know too many people – shoot, I don't know if anybody works harder than Dejuan. So, he deserved it. And um, he's still growing, too. He's, he's capable more. I just got – I got a lot of great teammates and uh, a, lot of, a, lot, a lot of talent. And you'll, you'll, as the time goes on, you'll see di uh, glimpses from different people. But uh, tonight, they, they, as well as others, showed up. And it looked like OU switched a lot, switched everything in the first half and maybe a little less so in the second half. How did you attack them uh, offensively? Uh, well, we knew that they were going to switch one through four and then hedge with the five man. Because, uh, I, I, like, we got great coaches. So, you know, the scout inside out. And um, my teammates and I, we, were, we listened to them, the coaches on the scout. Uh, Coach Henderson, as I said, it was his scout. And um, we, we knew what we were looking for. And um, as we, we've, we've grown throughout the season, we learned – what works on offense against switches, against fives that hedge, stuff like that. And um, we, 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 we found, we made the right plays tonight and that's what allowed us to get the win. Uh, 